When a narcissist decides to separate from their life partner, they are determined to completely destroy the partner and make them feel less than human, creating feelings of helplessness, anxiety, and frustration. This occurs in toxic relationships that are based on exploitation and selfishness, which should never happen. At this stage, the narcissist causes extreme frustration, helplessness, and a sense of inadequacy in the person, making them doubt their nature and psyche, and creating a feeling of being abnormal. In this stage, the person feels a collapse and loses the ability to think clearly due to the psychological harm caused by the narcissist, and consequently, they feel like they no longer know themselves. Although my way of speaking is in the form of mentioning to facilitate information transfer, it is necessary to know that everything we discuss about narcissism is not specific to any particular gender, whether it's women or men. The narcissistic personality we are talking about can be either male or female. Thank you very much for your support. If you find this content helpful, please like, subscribe, and share. Thank you for helping to share this message with those who can benefit from it. In the beginning of a relationship, the narcissist seeks to present themselves perfectly and make the partner feel loved, cared for, and appreciated. However, these feelings and actions are often fake and not genuine, with the aim of attracting the partner and gaining control over them. In this stage, the narcissist tries to control the partner and make them feel dependent on them, using beautiful emotions and sweet words as a means to achieve this goal. However, it becomes clear later that this relationship is not genuine, and the narcissist is only seeking to fulfill their personal goals without caring about their partner's feelings. The narcissist's behavior in the relationship may change due to the desire to attract the partner and gain control over them, not because of any genuine changes in their personality. In this stage, the narcissist seeks to control the partner and make them feel subjugated, using criticism and accusations as a means to achieve this goal. The narcissist takes full control of the partner's life and becomes a very negative personality. The partner begins to feel shocked and disappointed, realizing that the person they thought loved them is actually a narcissist who only seeks to achieve their personal goals. When your partner in the relationship occasionally behaves badly towards you, you may think it's normal, and conflicts happen in any relationship due to various pressures in life. It's common to seek excuses and forgiveness for your partner because you value the relationship and the good treatment you receive. However, you always appreciate the kind treatment, attention, and love that were present at the beginning of the relationship. Sometimes, you may blame yourself for any problems or behaviors by the narcissistic person and take responsibility, saying, I'm the reason for his provocation or I'm the reason for his behavior towards me. If you do this, you definitely want to maintain the relationship and keep it going smoothly. You always try to make things work and stay that way. However, you should be cautious of the real danger, which is getting used to making concessions in order to keep the relationship going or make it stay good. This gives the narcissist greater control over you, and they become accustomed to the bad behaviors they exhibit toward you. When the other person in the relationship is a narcissist, they seek to ensure your presence in their life in a certain way. They feel comfortable in their actions because they rely on your kind responses and tolerance, even if they mistreat you, in the hope of maintaining the relationship. They are sure that you are committed to the relationship and do not even consider ending it because of their behavior. However, the narcissist will not give you anything in return, and they will drain you without reciprocating. Attention, Care, love, and feelings are expected from you continuously, without anything in return from them. The narcissist seeks a person who can tolerate their flaws and their sick personality, trying to compensate for their negative traits with someone like you who can endure them in a relationship of this kind. Over time, you will feel uncomfortable and constantly tired in this relationship, and it will be hard on your psyche. When dealing with a narcissistic person, you will feel like you are just a tool they use to achieve their personal goals, and you care for them and try to satisfy them in vain, while they do not care about you and do not consider your feelings. The narcissist feeds on their sense of being better and more important than others, always seeking to manipulate and deceive to achieve their personal interests. As time goes on, you will experience constant fatigue and exhaustion, becoming emotionally and mentally drained. You will enter a phase of depression and anxiety, feeling like everything you do is futile, and you will find it difficult to control your emotions. 
When dealing with a narcissistic person, you put in a great deal of effort every day to try to meet their demands and please them, hoping that they will return to the person they were at the beginning of the beautiful relationship. However, this is impossible to happen, and this is something you need to acknowledge and deal with. In reality, the narcissist slowly destroys you, stealing your identity, energy, care, attention, and focus, making you weaker than you imagine and unable to weigh matters or think clearly. The more you try to change the situation you are in, the more frustrated and mentally exhausted you will feel, unable to bring about any change. When you reach this stage, the narcissist knows that you no longer have any value to them, and they can no longer obtain any energy or sustenance from you, as they have drained you completely. Since you no longer provide the narcissist with the attention and happiness they used to get from you, they start to feel bored with you and consider abandoning you to search for a new source of supply. In this stage, you must realize that the narcissist continues with their life and has their usual way of living, unaffected by anything you go through. They become more active in searching for a new source to meet their needs. Nevertheless, sometimes the victim tries to convince the narcissist to stay with them and not leave, but this is futile because the narcissist has no feelings or compassion for anyone. They only care about themselves and achieving their personal goals. When the narcissist reaches this stage, they mercilessly accuse you of no longer being the person they once knew and claim that you have no value to them. They feign victimhood and place blame on you for what has happened. They begin to abandon and ignore you, despite all the life, energy, and nourishment you provided them. At this stage, the narcissist realizes that they have exhausted everything they used to get from you, and you no longer offer them anything beneficial. Consequently, they lose interest in you and terminate the relationship. This is the reason the narcissist completely destroys you before leaving because they need to drain every last ounce of your energy and resources before letting go of you. Therefore, you must be wary of narcissists, protect yourself, establish boundaries, focus on self-care, and take the necessary steps to break free from this toxic relationship.